Oh, there he goes. This is the first of the big launchers. <laughs> well, it was a matter of time, wasn't it? And Kyle Mills had been just concentrating just outside Chris Gale's off stump. And this one pitched up enough, close enough to him. And straight through the line. Another six straight down the ground. Well, there we go again. This could be something really spectacular from Chris Gale, and we've seen a lot from him anyway. Big mistake by Kyle Mills. Huge. Pitched up right in Chris Gale's zone. He makes it up to the first tier of corporate boxes. How he chooses well in his areas. There we go again. It's not gone as far, but it's six nevertheless. Kyle Mills had better start doing some thinking and quick. Well, he almost projected that, didn't he? When you look at his batting stance, he was really in position so early. Got a lot more height than distance this time, but at the end of it all, it's another six in the scorebook. He's looking to go over the top again in response. Thousands of voices with a breathed a sigh of relief with the last delivery, and this is why. Good use of the feet. And again, looks to hit with the, the angle of the ball. Nice and straight. Didn't really seem to hit it that hard, but the weight went. And that's the first along the ground to the boundary from Gale's bat. He's been dealing in sixes so far. Now you, again, up to the bat and Gale goes off for it. This is a tremendous hitting by Chris Gale. We've seen it so often. More recently in the shortest form of the game, T20s, but now he's doing it here as he did it in the first one day international. There he goes. No question about where that's going. It's gone even over our heads. Wow. First ball of a new spell for Taryn Nathula. And it is right in Chris Gale's arc. My goodness. That's gone out of here. Well, appropriately, it's headed towards a sign saying exit in the George Headley stand. You can talk about hitting leg side, but Gale's ability to hit the ball over long off an extra cover as well is underestimated. And that's gone over the top again. It's easily hit. Just uh, no effort in that shot at all. Very easily struck over the head of long off. This takes him to 98. He paces as it. Uh, he might have just got an under edge onto that through the keeper it goes and he signals a four and that scales 100 it's his 20th 100 in one day internationals got an under edge onto it through the keeper's legs spectators teammates and Gale himself absolutely delighted to have come back here at Sabina Park after all that's gone on and scored this tremendous 100. Down the ground and over the top. Another six. A flat six this time. 
struck beautifully by Gale. And Athulas has to ensure that his length is precise where Gale can't hit him down the ground as easy with this power. His length can't be too short, but it mustn't be that full. I recommend uh, that he take his hand away when Gale drives powerfully back to him. You saw what happened to the left arm spinner here. He got his finger broken when he got his hand to a fair straight drive. This time I think Mathula thought better of it, pulled his hand out of the way. Good.